You know, in uh, these difficult times, I feel that it's healing to the soul to make fun of people who are less fortunate than ourselves. <laughs> I mean, that's why I became an entertainer to get up on stage to remind myself that I'm better than everybody else. <laughs> and you know, we play benefits because, I mean, we feel we owe something to society. We are responsible people. And the sad fact is most people out there, they just don't give a crap, you know? But you and I, we not only give a crap, but we take a crap each and every day. Because that's the kind of people we are. We're regular people. We don't need any laxatives. We care about the environment. For instance, do we really need to be breathing all of that air? Or could each and every one of us breathe just a little bit less? Save some for the coal burning plants. And as a matter of fact, here we are in Austin, Texas. LBJ, author of The Great Society, Civil Rights, and so, I'd like to make a proposal here. Oh, yeah! All right, here it comes. Don't Ask, Don't Tell has worked so well for gays in the military. I'd like to propose that we extend Don't Ask, Don't Tell to black people. I mean, Jackie Robinson could have broken into the major leagues without getting spit on or called the N-word if we had Don't Ask, Don't Tell for black people. If we had Don't Ask, Don't Tell for Black People, Martin Luther King would still be alive. Think about that, but not too long. And nobody